Hi there! In this quick tutorial I'll show you how to use the new functionality we've added to Modeler 057. It's called the Development Timeline and you can find it under the sur Survey tab uh, inside the Development Timeline panel. As you can see, there is this slider here where you can move through the years but nothing happens at the moment because uh, no building has any date set at, uh, when, when they are created. In order to set the dates for the building, go and select it, go to the building tab, open, expand this uh, selected building parameters panel so you can see the construction and demolition year and set the date. As you can see in this presentation, I have added some uh, notes here so you can easier follow me how I'm changing the building. So when I change this one to 2019, nothing happens. It's, it's the first building with the date set, but you can see that the development timeline has changed. The rule for this is that the development timeline always adapts to the years of the buildings, so it always takes the the first year minus one to set the, the initial date and the last year of something being be built in the development area plus one. So for now it's only 2019, only one building that has the date set. So let's add some more. We can also do it in bulk. As you can see here, this will, these are supposed to be built in 2022. When I add the date, they disappear. This is because uh, the development timeline is still set to 2020, uh, uh, 2019. When I go to 2022, they reappear again. As you can see, the, the calculations are always updated. Okay, and now for this building, uh, we will only be creating it once this one here is demolished. So. Let's set this one uh, demolition year to 2024 and this one will be built in the 2025. So again it disappeared because of the date set in the development timeline. As you can see in 2024 this one disappears and in 2025 the new building appears. This way you can easily see how the area will develop through time like this okay and all the parameters are calculated on the fly there is another new functionality we've added to modeler 057 which is the option to add only uh, lo lodges to or terraces only to parts of the building so for this you have to enter the building um, set the some new edges to, to split the faces, okay? And then you can easily use push-pull as ordinary and modeler will add new lodges or terraces. So that's it for now. Thanks for watching.